First, we are gonna start out with a clear mason jar, which I love being from down south. I grew up around these. And I'm going to be using the Adirondack alcohol inks. They all usually come in a package of three. And this particular one is called Nature Walk. And the color I'm going to be using is called Stream, which is kind of cool because we're having like a nature theme with all the flowers and everything. So I'm going to start out with a brand new bottle because it actually does use quite a bit. But I think that I, we did get this whole project done with one bottle, so you don't have to worry about buying a second set unless, you know, you're practicing, you might end up needing a second bottle, but it does really go a long way. And the way that I'm going to do this is I have used these before on one of my projects, and again, I have found the best way to do this is to start out by just squeezing it on, and I, you want to press the bottle pretty, pretty firmly so that the alcohol ink comes out fast because it does dry very quickly. Just make sure you're getting a really good coat and don't worry if it's looking streaky because you will be taking care of that on the second coat. Just work your way around. It's best if you have your hand inside the jar and facing downward and having like a paper plate, that's usually what we use is a paper plate underneath to catch all the excess because there will be quite a bit that is gonna fall off the jar. And the last thing you want is to have it on your table or on your clothes. Okay, so I've gone all the way around the jar. Now when you're squeezing this on there, it is gonna have some streaks in it and you can go over that with a second coat using a brush, which will eliminate all of the streaks if you want a more clean, classic look, depending on what the project is. But for this one, we decided we're just going to leave it a little streaky because it gave some character to the jars, which really suited the type of project that we wanted to accomplish. We're also going to be using alcohol ink for the leaves on our project. And for the, le for the leaves, we used four different colors. We used oregano and ginger and lettuce and the fourth color is actually called bottle it took us a minute we actually thought they forgot to put the name of the color on the bottle but it actually is called bottle so don't be confused by that like we were so i'm just going to go ahead and show you on our next step how to color the leaves <laughs> 